Now well, it's about uh, 47 degrees. Just parked the truck. And it's the week before bow hunting starts, so I might as well walk back and see how the ground blind is doing. See what's going on. Obviously, the vegetation is very thick up here. So we'll see. Probably about way down there by that white spot. You can't see it, but it's about a mile. And I go back into the woods. Right now, the first mile is easy. It's on this snowmobile trail, old logging road. Then through that clearing. And then I'll get back into the woods. And obviously, some trucks are walking, are going back in here. So maybe it's not that wet. Now I've left the logging trail, obviously, and walking across this little clearing back into the woods there where I got some ground blinds. Ferns are starting to die a little bit. And, uh, nice cool morning again, like I said. Now here's one of the ground blinds, and last year I actually did have a buck come in right about by the second one that's right up there that's closer I just for some reason I was sitting at the wrong side of the blind and I couldn't get it but this year I'm gonna go bait free and see what happens otherwise I had more does and bucks come in here but they came in here at the wrong time so we'll see what happens when mother nature controls there you know, let's hope it dies out and back in there, I gotta find that there's a tree that's uprooted, which is a good place for gun season. Right here's the overturned tree. I had took plenty of videos last year. The doe's right out in there, but I didn't have a doe permit for public land, so I just could watch them, and that's it. And. Uh, We'll see what happens this year.